Hey guys, Thundee E here, and yes, I don't do a lot of Apple devices or accessories for Apple devices. This video is all about that. I'm gonna show you a bunch of cool accessories that you can use for your iOS devices. Now, the first one centers around the Apple AirPods. You're thinking, hmm, maybe should I, I wanna upgrade from the AirPods 1 to the AirPods 2. I say, no, don't. Check out our video on the AirPods 2 and why you shouldn't. But if you go to the original AirPods, this, uh, there are a couple of things here that you can actually use. First off is basically something that allows you to keep your AirPods in your ears. Now, I have a very hard time keeping them in my ears, but I've got this really cool new accessory that is small, thin, and also allows it to fit in your ear. So I can do this. And then basically when I fit it in and I shake my head, doesn't fall off. That's what I like about it. Now, what's cool about these accessories is that they are reasonable for $8.99. They come with different rubberized tips in here, and you can have tips that have hooks and uh, different form factors or sizes to fit you really well. But the best part about it is that the regular tips can go ahead and slide into your AirPod case, and you can close it. That's the really cool part about it. Again, it's all $8.99 for that. Now, the next accessory here is for those who are looking for wireless charging. You've seen the AirPods 2 has wireless charging. You've seen the Galaxy Buds have wireless charging. You know you want that too for your device. Very simple. I've got a case for you that's $29.99. All you have to do is go ahead and slide in your AirPods into the case, connect via lightning cable, and you can drop it on your wireless charging stand. And it's easy and simple. You've got wireless charging right there. Speaking of wireless charging stands, since of course the uh, you know the uh, the wireless charging stand from Apple just didn't show up and became vaporware. I've got something that is really cool and really good. I'm talking about the um, the Samsung uh, wireless charger 2.0 pad. It's a two pad charger. One is wireless charging 2.0. One is wireless charging 1.0, uh, which it's got cooling there so it doesn't overheat. It works out really well, and I think this is probably one of the best wireless charging pads for your AirPods or your iPhone if you choose to use that as well. So some nice offerings there for you on the uh, wireless charging, the AirPods and all that fun stuff. So our next accessory here is the WeThings Buddy Plus Scale, which retails for $99. And you're thinking, a scale? Well, this is a great tool in that fitness journey. It's something you can buy with, of course, your iPhone to easily check and monitor where your fitness goals are. Plus, you do have the ability to tie it into Apple Health uh, to see things like your body fat, muscle mass, and all that fun stuff. So when you're spending time working out like I do when I kickbox, this goes in a long way to add in a whole lot of features. Now, this maps out to, of course, your weights. It also maps out to your BMI, your body fat, and you can see this directly on the scale when you actually step on it um, and showcasing all those different aspects of your health tracking that you want to see um, throughout uh, right there on the scale and also tells you what the weather is for the day. I really like this tool because it's helped me map out what I want to do and also fits pretty well. Runs on four AAA batteries and it is a great tool if you're fitness minded and only retails for $99. So our next accessory here centers around your iPhone. Now the iPhone 10 or the 10X Max or any iPhone you have, uh, of course you've got a lot of great, really great games on there, but you may not want to spend money on all those games, but you want to get a case that really accessorizes your style. This is a Game Boy style case, but what's different about this case that yes, it looks like a Game Boy, it makes your iPhone look like a Game Boy, is that it also works like a gaming device. You can hit the on button to turn it on, and you can select from various games out there to actually do a lot of work in, which is really, really cool. So I like that about it, and it functions really well. You can jump from game to game, you can try different games, your buttons function. Uh, the only downside, it charges via micro USB, and it doesn't bring any extra power to your iPhone. So that's the only downside there. But if you're at the airport and you're not able to download more games on your phone, you can just flip your device around and start gaming. So this is pretty cool. And it retails for about between 20 to about $30, depending on which iOS device you have. But I definitely like it. 
Now, this one is something that a lot of you know um, iOS users or iPhone users are quite familiar. You need, of course, an extra battery for your iPhone. Now, I have something that's even much better than a charging case. I'm talking about the uh, Mofi uh, Stream Power Station Wireless. Now, the Stream Power Station Wireless is pretty cool. It's a portable power bank uh, that comes with about 6,500 milliamp uh, uh, battery built in there. Uh, you can charge directly to your device via cable. It, it does recharge via micro. Uh, sorry, by, via uh, USB type C. But the cool thing is also it doubles as a wireless charging pad. So you can take this with you on the go. You can place your uh, iPhone down and, and charge it directly or say even your um, you know, Apple AirPods 2 uh, or AirPods 1 with the charging case on top of that as well. And you can charge a secondary device. It's nice, it's simple, and again, it's easy to take with you on the road and it's got a really nice small form factor. So I do like that about it. And I think a lot of people will. Now, last but not the least is the Logitech Folio Pro um, iPad Pro case. This is a keyboard case for your iPad Pro. What I like about this case is that it has a lot of functionality. Of course, it's a folio case, which means it covers, of course, your iPad screen, whether it's the 11 inch or the 12.9, they've got different variants, 12.9, the third generation, of course. And the keyboard has some really nice travel on there as well. Uh, plus, you do have the ability to actually place your Apple Pencil on the very top, so you have that as well. And it's really nice and simple case to use, and I think a lot of people like it. Pricing is between 111 to 120, $129, and I think it is uh, a worthwhile case to pick up uh, instead of the Apple cases for your iPad. So there you have it, guys. Those are the accessories that I do like for uh, Apple devices uh, across the board, whether it's your iPhone, your AirPods, your iPad, uh, if you're looking to charge or game, there are a couple of things that you'll find. I have all the links for you down below, so you guys can go ahead, go ahead and check it out. If you wanna pick any of them up, definitely use the links as well. Otherwise, don't forget to like and share this video, favorite this video. If there's anything you want me to make or do, please leave comments down below. I'll try to make those videos for you. I'll try to make this a series where I do my best accessories every month. It would differ from iOS, Android, doesn't matter what the device is that I think a lot of people will like to see. So thank you and always enjoy your entertainment.